Hello there, it's Ellie here. And in this video, I am talking about day number two of our affiliate marketing sales challenge. Okay, so if you don't know um, what we're doing already this week, um, we're basically working together on um, helping uh, people to get affiliate marketing sales. And the way we're doing that is by providing um, all of the tools and um, guidance and everything like that completely for free um, by using our website, uh, Simple Steps to Success. Um, now that's the same website that was called Simple Downline Builder Success, but I've decided to change the name um, because really um, there's so much more on the site than just a downline builder. It's all about training. It's all about um, you know helping you to get sales. It's um, it's all about helping you with team building as well. So this little challenge then is uh, is our way really of helping you to learn the processes that are involved in becoming a successful affiliate marketer. Okay, so if you have heard anything about affiliate marketing before, or indeed if you have tried it. Um, you will probably know that it's one of those things that sounds really, really simple. And uh, this little diagram shows exactly how it works. So the affiliate, or you know, the person who's um, going to be promoting the item, um, puts their ad onto their website. Or you know, you can put your ad on social media. Um, uh, you can send it by email. All the, all of these different things. So so basically, you get a, a unique link to this product that you're wanting to sell and you get that link from you know a, a network provider or from the um, owner of the product themselves so basically you get the link and you promote it you're 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 placing the link somewhere that's what that's your job as an affiliate once you have done the promotions then what happens is the customer then clicks on your referral link your unique referral link and um, they either buy the product or they don't buy the product. So if they buy the product, that's called a conversion. So it's saying here, customer clicks and converts. So that means that they actually purchase the product. So then we go round uh, to this part. The conversions are actually tracked. And that is to do with your unique um, link that you have. It's a bit like a referral link, really. And the... Um, the link that you have means that the uh, the sales that are made at this stage are tracked and linked to your specific URL. So once you uh, once that happens, then the affiliate gets a commission because you have had a sale made over here. Okay, so it's really easy, right? <laughs> All you have to do is get a link, share the link customer makes a purchase and ka -ching, you make a commission <laughs> but the thing is you know people who are trying to make affiliate marketing commissions that you know they they all think it's going to be really really easy and pretty much every time it just doesn't happen and people get really confused and frustrated because it's like well you know all I have to do is share this link but you know I'm, and I'm, I'm doing that. I'm sharing my link everywhere I can think of. And yet, I'm not making any sales. Or, if you're very lucky, then you might make one or two sales um, during the process of trying to share it. But you get to the point where you think, okay, you know, it's taken me hours and hours <laughs> and hours trying to do all this sharing of this link. And, um, you know, I've made a couple of pounds or a couple of dollars. And really, it's not worth it. That is because we're working on the luck side of the coin instead of the skill side of the coin. Okay, so today then I just I want to talk a little bit more about the actual sales process itself, and uh, and I want to highlight again just about the the difference between um, you know the 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 luck option. Um, where you're you're just sending out your link and, and you just hit lucky and the skills process okay so in the sales process if you if you do any research at all about sales 
then it's going to tell you that there are seven steps in the sales process. And this is where, um, you know, uh, uh, this is why people get so frustrated with regard to affiliate marketing sales, because what they do is they start with step number one, which is, you know, basically trying to find people who are interested in your product. So, so prospecting, you're, you're looking for your potential customers. That's step number one. Now, if you look for your customers or your potential customers, and then you jump straight to, you know, here is the product, you're going from step number one, boom, straight over here, step number five, which is presenting your solutions. And I'm, I'm going to talk more about the solutions in a second. But this is why, because the person's going from here to here, they haven't, they haven't met any of these steps. And that is why um, it doesn't usually work whenever people are brand new to affiliate marketing. They're just going from here, and right across to here. <laughs> and the other thing is this part in the middle, focus on the customer. This is another thing that is not um, not actually happening. Most of the time, the person who is new to affiliate marketing is focused on one thing, and that is making a sale. That is not focus on the customer. Okay, so let's just have a quick look round at the different steps. So we're going from step number one, which is prospecting. And, uh, you know, as I said yesterday, um, this is where you are sharing your capture page. This is where you're filtering out the people who are not interested in um, your product and filtering in or collecting the details for the people who are most likely to actually buy it. So step number two, let's talk about that for a second. So it says here initial meeting. Now we're talking mostly about email marketing now. So an actual meeting is not what we're really talking about. So we're looking at this. So it's about establishing rapport. It's about building a relationship with your potential customer. The second part of this is very, very important. You need to gain trust to be able to move to the next step. If you have not gained the trust of that person, the chances are that they will never make a purchase from you. If you have not got any trust with, um, you know, with that person, you haven't built up the relationship. You haven't allowed them to, you know, to get to know you and know that you're a trustworthy person. Um, if you haven't done that, the chances are that you will never, ever make a sale. So with, a, with the email marketing and with the process that I'm providing, I am doing this part for you because I send the follow-up emails. So you are doing this part, this, the prospecting, as you would have always been doing. Um, but this time, instead of trying to go from here, right across to here, then I am taking care of this part. I am the one who is providing value. I am the one who is talking to the person about, you know, what affiliate marketing is, about, um, you know, why the, uh, the product, which is our affiliate bot software, um, I'm talking about why this particular um, product might meet their needs. Now, that then is moving us over into step number three. So gathering facts. You want to gather facts from your customers. And there are ways and means of doing that with email marketing as well. Such as, you know, if you send an email with a, with a title saying things like, do you want to automate your affiliate marketing sales? If the person opens that email, then you know that they are interested in automating their um, affiliate marketing sales. Now, if they don't open it, it's, it might not be the fact that they're not interested. It might be because they didn't see it or whatever. But if they actually open it, then that's where you're gathering data. You are gathering facts. You know for a fact that that person is interested in automation of their affiliate marketing. Agreeing on their needs. Now, this one gets a little bit more complicated with email marketing. Um, but basically what you can do is, you know, you can, um, you can make assumptions. You know, you can, you can say within the email, you know, okay, so basically I'm, you know, assuming 
that what your needs are, that you want to work on affiliate marketing, that you want to make more uh, affiliate marketing sales, that perhaps you have been trying to do that for a little while and not getting anywhere. So you can say all of these things in the emails. Again, this is where I am working for you. Now, once you have actually agreed on the needs, then you can look a lot more at the solutions. So you're, you're saying, okay, so if you're interested in actually automating your affiliate marketing sales and you want to, you know, make more sales in an easier way, then one of the solutions that you might want to look at is actually working with us over on Simple Steps to Success. Because one of the things that we do is we provide this service where all you need to do is step number one with the prospecting. We send the emails for step number two. We send the emails for step number three. We talk about the actual solutions and, you know, we then start to develop the proposal. If the person then, you know, if you're correct, if you have uh, established their needs correctly, and if you are able to present them with um, a possible solution or two or three different solutions, then that person is going to gain a lot more trust in your ability to actually suggest something that's going to work for them. So that's where this is coming in as well. So all of these steps, steps number two, three, and four, those steps can all be taken care of with um, with well crafted and well written emails. Once that happens, then we can start to present the solutions. We can start to say to that person, okay, so if I'm hearing you correctly, what what you're saying to me is that you want to work on affiliate marketing. You want to increase the number of sales that you're getting. You want to spend less time doing it. You want to um, start to automate the process. If those things are all correct, then here is a solution that I think you might um, be interested in or that I know is going to meet your needs. So this is step number five. This is where you're presenting the item for sale. Now, again, let's talk about the skill part and the, um, uh, the luck part. As a new affiliate marketer, what happens is you go from here, ching, right across to here, and chances are you're going to miss out on these steps as well. So step number six is all about, you know, monitoring the actual process or their progress with, um, with your solution. So it's all about following up with the person to say, okay, so you bought this, this product, how are you getting on with it? Um, you know, are you... Are you using it okay? Are you um, getting um, better results with it? And you know, all of that is very, very important because if you do that, if you follow up with the person and then you, um, you can talk to them about step number seven, which is ongoing service. In other words, they become a regular customer and they go back through the whole process for more and more affiliate marketing products, for example. So, you know, if, if they have purchased something from you, they, they know that they can trust you. Um, you have um, established their needs. You have um, designed their proposal. You have sent them a link to something that is going to help them. You have followed up with them. You've said, you know, how are you getting on with that? Do you need any help with it? Um, I can give you some extra guidance if you need it, then the chances are that they are going to become a regular customer because they will look at what you're sending again. You can say, okay, now I know you really like that product. Um, if you're ready for the next step, then you might want to look at this one. So you can kind of work back around the circle again. And this, this step is one of the main reasons why um, uh, professional marketers it can earn a very big income because they're not looking at a one-time sale. They're not going from here -ching, to here and that's it. They're not going, okay, yay, I made some money. But they're not in that process. They are in the full process of providing customer service. Their focus is completely on the customer. Okay, so let's just talk very quickly about the idea of the problem and the solution um, 
you know when it comes to the sales process now at the minute what we're doing is you and i you are my um customer you are my potential customer and i am working with you to help you solve the problem of getting affiliate marketing sales now i have already said to you what the solution for this is as far as i'm concerned is um is for you to use my website simple steps to success and the reason for that is because then i can do the follow-up emails i can do all of those things i can use my training and experience to help you to overcome one of the biggest barriers to affiliate marketing and that is knowing how to actually build the trust knowing how to build rapport knowing how to talk about their customers needs knowing how to and when to actually start to move into talking about the solution and all of those kind of things so what that's what we are already working on however we still have a problem because i can only send those emails for you if there are people registered um, by using your referral link to the site simple steps to success so we still have a problem but the problem is now getting smaller and smaller because i've already taken care of several parts of it so the main problem that we are going to be focusing on from now on is the problem that um you know you need to actually get subscribers okay so um as i said the um the problem then that we need to work on is for you to get more and more subscribers to simple steps to success however it's it's important that those subscribers are people who are already interested in affiliate marketing now one of the things that i am doing um, in, during this challenge is actually introducing you to various different um, websites that are in my opinion some of the best sites that you can get um, affiliate marketers um, details from so this is one of those sites it's called viral url and uh, one of the reasons why this is a very important site um, is if i just start to play the video here for for a second it's shocking that over 300 percent of affiliate commissions are stolen away from okay so they're talking straight away about affiliate commissions in other words this website viral url has a target audience of affiliate marketers so here is one of the one of the sites where i i you know i've got get lots and lots of um, subscribers and sales from this site so um yeah it's it's a very very good site and uh, certainly worth working on during the challenge so let's just log in and i can show you how to how to work on this site okay so this is the dashboard then just inside viral url and you know for registering all you need to do is have your email address and create a password um, you do need to confirm it through your email as far as i can remember i've been on this site for many years now so i can't quite remember but i'm pretty sure you need to just verify your email address as well so once you have actually joined um, viral url then um, what you need to do on this site is to actually have some um, advertising credits so that you can contact people um, on the site now as with most um, of the traffic sites you can use viral url um, as a completely free member or you can um, pay for an upgraded account and um, you can choose to have free membership if that suits you best to use the free option then you just need to click on some um, emails to collect some free advertising credits and uh, if you want to then you can as i say upgrade now the one that i personally use is the silver upgrade and the reason for that is um, it's actually it's this credit mailer upgrade um, so if i click on here it will tell you more about this um, upgrade how would you like to mail 1,000 people within the next few minutes and then another 200 each and every day from now on hi my name is colin okay so this is the uh, the uh, the option that i personally use and um this one you can see where is it it costs there it is um a monthly investment of seven dollars 
and um, you know being able to contact people um, on viral URL every three days and um, being able to send the um, the email straight away to 1,000 people um, in my opinion it's certainly worth the um, payment of seven dollars as i said i get a lot of sales and a lot of um, subscribers from here however if you prefer you can of course keep with a free membership now the way you're going to do that is through the mailer section so you can just click on here and you can see that there are a few different options you've got downline mailer you've got random mailer and you've got the message center now, if you click first of all on message center then what you're going to see is a list of the emails that have already been sent out so it shows you here below are the last 200 messages sent by our members to a minimum of 3,000 other members so um, these are the ones that are being sent out to 3,000 um, of the, the members of viral URL so you the chances are that just by sending one email on here because you're sending it to 3,000 highly targeted um, audience members <laughs> for your offer then the chances are you will get um, uh, some referrals on here or some uh, subscribers now to actually build up the um, uh, the email credits then all you need to do is actually click on the messages in the message center now I do want to just show you across here at the side it's got some extra information here so it's called the open rank the click rank and the comment rank now they in this site uh, in viral URL what they're doing is they're helping you to actually learn you know how um, how effective the uh, emails are so this is to do with your actual subject line so let me just look here very quickly here's one that has an open rank of one look at this title quickest 123 ever or 123 dollars ever so this email is 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 getting no interest at all and uh, you know the reason for that is because it's saying nothing you know quickest one 123 dollars ever apart from the fact that most people on this site are probably making a lot more money than that um, then you know this is this is an email that's not getting very much interest and um, some of the higher ones then you're looking at 118 so that you know the higher the number then the more people that are are opening it so get exposure to loads of potential buyers okay so we know straight away that this is a kind of email that is um, uh, getting a lot of interest by the members on this site. Here's another one. Get 5,000 subscribers every 24 hours. So we know that these people, the people that are on Viral URL, they're interested in list building. They're interested in buyers. In other words, they are doing everything that's related to affiliate marketing. Okay, so um, whenever you're working on viral URL, then um, if you have a free account, then you just need to click on some emails to earn some credits. So let me just click on this one and it will open up in the new box. And all you need to do then is find the link inside, click on the link. And it's going to open up in a new tab here, as you can see. And just up at the top here, you'll see the timer. After you count down, you can check to see, you know, what you've won or what, you know, um, what you're going to get from opening the email. So click on the right coloured um, number and I have received one GV credit. Now GV credit is called a guaranteed visitor credit. And you can see here that I currently have 104 um, guaranteed credits. Um, you can also then um, claim another 30 ad credits. So if you're wanting advertising credits, um, then that's the one that you want to do. And it'll just keep uh, opening emails then. And you will see that um, you will get 30 ad credits after the countdown. So it's a 30 second one here, as you can see. So it just takes a little bit longer. Um, but you will be getting more of the advertising credits um, for doing that. Now the guaranteed visitors bit works slightly differently. Um, 
so I would advise that you work first of all on the advertising credits um, part rather than the guaranteed visitors. So as, as usual, you're just clicking on the right coloured box and, uh, and then it will automatically start moving across. You can see here I've already earned 30 at credits. OK, so we'll, we'll not um, <laughs> we'll not spend too much time going through that. You know, that's all you need to do. Um, build up your advertising credits. And I would suggest that you try to aim for at least um, probably about a thousand or more um, credits per day if you can build them up. Now, you're going to need 3000 credits to be able to send your first email. But once you've done that, um, it is quite quick and easy. You can just um, keep clicking on the on the coloured box and you will get more and more advertising credits. So once you have actually built up your credits, then all you need to do is click on random mailer and then it's going to take you to this, a similar box to the one that is over on Ads Messenger. So all you need to do is enter your subject line in the box here. Um, you can copy and paste the text message. There is no um, URL box on this one. So you just add the URL inside the actual main body of the email here. When you're sending it, then um, you can choose whether you want it to come from member at viral URL or you can um, send it you know, from your actual uh, uh, Gmail address or the email address that you've used to register. And, um, you know, you might want to um, try varying those to see uh, which is most um, uh, useful. Um, I, I would often quite use the, um, the one that gives you uh, your actual email address. And, um, and then you can choose to, uh, you know, they, these are going out to random people. So you can say randomly select members and depends on how many credits you've got then it'll uh, it'll tell you here how many you can send to now in in um, viral url you can target specific people so for example on uh, on here we know that there are um, 6361 usa members um, you oh, we also know that there are 7041 um, USA and Canadian members. Um, you can send then, you know, to a combination of USA, Canada, UK, Australia, New Zealand. So those ones are the um, the, the tier one countries basically. Um, and we also know then that there are 997 um, people who are in the UK. Now you can change this to whatever country that you want to actually target. So it's a very, very good um, option if you have an offer that's available um, you know just in a particular country so you can target people here um, although it does take um, a little bit more in terms of credits so um, you can use those um, so yeah that's a it's a very good option and as I said all you want to do is just send your email put it in the in the email box here as usual and uh, you can I would suggest that you just send it to random um, viral URL members because the offer that we are promoting um, is available worldwide. So you can use that option. Just go to the bottom then once you're ready and click send email. Now I can't actually send it right now because I have um, I've just sent an email. <laughs> I just sent one yesterday. So um, I, uh, you can only send an email on here every three days. Um, but you will find that it's a very, very effective site. OK, so that was a very, very quick um, introduction then to viral URL. Um, as I said, really, all you need to work on at the minute is the mailer section. And um, you can actually add, if you go to uh, get exposure, um, you can add the um, different options here as well. Um, but as I said, the mailer is definitely the most effective um, on this site. So hopefully you have found um, this video useful um, for your day two and you have learned a bit more about affiliate marketing and uh, of course um, as I always say you know if you can send more emails 
um, out then do so you know the the more people that you contact with your capture page then the more likely you are to get more subscribers however I would be very surprised if you don't actually get any subscribers from sending a, an email on viral URL okay so that's it really from me for today and uh, I will talk to you again tomorrow okay talk to you then um, happy promoting. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>